Hey guys, uh, welcome to Doom Eternal, and I've been looking forward to this one for a while. Ooh, customize. Ooh, default. Yeah, so they added um, stuff to this game, uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, so this, as far as I can, I, the customization, as far as I can tell, is just like a, either a multiplayer thing or something, a battle mode, I guess, maybe, I don't know. Um, yeah, my, my computer did not... Uh, handle this too well. Um, I had to kind of bump down the settings slightly, mostly medium. Um, <laughs> I, I, my computer is showing its age a bit. What can you do? Um, anyways, so it seems kind of fun. I played like the first, I don't know, 40 minutes or hour almost, I guess. Um, just, just kind of tr trying it out, uh, seeing what I like and what I don't like. Um, it's good. Uh, seems pretty good so far. As I said, I can't judge it by the first hour, but, you know, I guess we'll see. Um, yeah, this is the game slot I was using. That's as far as I got. Uh, and this probably is no surprise to you as you've seen the, um, uh, the title. I'm going to be playing this on, uh, Nightmare. This is a really bad idea for me to be doing this, but I'm doing it anyways. Um, because I, I started, when I did 2016... I did an ultra violence, and I near the end of the game I got really used to it, and it was pretty easy by the end. I think Nightmare is going to basically be hard up front for me, but as I get into it more, it'll be just at my level, I think. Um, if not, I guess sucks to be me, right? Um, so just as a forewarning, I'm going to die a lot, and this is probably longer than a lot of other ones you're going to see, if if you're like just trying to pick one on YouTube. But I mean. I, if I'm gonna do nightmare, I'm gonna fucking do nightmare. So I don't think I'm gonna die that much, but I guess I guess we'll see. Uh, I mean, there'll be a couple of stupid shit that goes on, but yeah, there's like um, enemies attack less often, do less damage, uh, do often and do meaningful damage. Ultra violence, they throw power attacks more often, which I've noticed that the um, the imps do like a kamehameha kind of thing, and there's some other ones too. It says death may be common early on as you master skills to dominate the combat experience, and then. Nightmare is just they, they fucking do everything. Ultra Nightmare, obviously we're not doing one death you fail because that's just stupid. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to part three where we're still on the first part of the game, uh, just starting over. I don't know what extra life. Uh, that's like uh, Doom One kind of thing. So yeah, we're doing Nightmare. Sucks to be me. Nah, I'm, I'm gonna have fun with this. Against all the evil that hell can conjure. All the wickedness that mankind can produce. We will send unto them only you. Rip and tear until it is done.
So, the first thing I'm going to tell you about this game that I've learned really fast is you do not have a lot of ammo. Like, at all. Like, 16 is the only amount of shells I have right now. Like, 16 is not a lot. Alright. It wants me to do glory kills. I'm going to keep the tutorials on just because, uh, you know, uh, obviously I don't necessarily know everything, but... Uh, it's helpful for you guys too if you've never seen Doom. But that's uh, the glory kills is like a main component of this game, actually, like very big. Uh, because actually, in Nightmare at least, that's the way you get all of your health back. I've noticed. So, and also he's got a nice little sword now. It also brings you to a training area from time to time where it explains to you the uh, the concept. This requires fuel, gas canisters and fuel to train. So uh, one fuel pip slowly refuels over time. So if you're down to zero, it'll kind of go back to one. And it's kind of important because like I said, ammo is very scarce in this game. I found, so it's been a, like, so I have no ammo right now. And it drops a bunch. It's the same as the other mechanic, like from the, uh, from the first game. Well, very similar, but there is the, the fact that you do get one slowly over time. So, it is kind of cool. And we got our auto map here. I wonder if there's... I can see something over here. What, what's over there? How do I get in there? I wonder. S train saw, obviously, no. I don't know. Oh, probably like up there. I don't know if there's way up there. I'll look a little later. Oh, well, you could probably now make it up there. Well, yeah. It's telling me the, the double jumping mechanic now. Okay, can I, like, knock it that way? No. I want that. Oh, who knows. Obviously, this is not a 100% all the secrets LMG 360 no scope run. Um, although, it could be. I mean, I'll spend a bit of time looking for secrets, but that one I'm, I'm not going to bother with. Uh, hello, I didn't punch it. Or maybe I did. Um, so this is the more of the mod weapon stuff. Um, they give it to you actually really fast, all the mods, I've noticed. Um, so in this particular case, it's talking about either sticky bombs or full auto. Um, given how my shotgun only has 16 rounds, I'm not sure why I'd want this early on. <laughs> just, just saying. By the way, there is no pistol. I this is my my only weapon, like right now. So I, I just let you guys know that. So I'm I'm, I'm actually a fan of the sticky bombs at least right now. But it seems like they have masters on top of that. So uh, to activate, press mouse two, press mouse plus one. You can read things in the dossier about it as well. We're not going to probably look at that too much. There's the the mod I just got. How much I guess, uh, yeah, I used two ammo for that too. So that's not good either. So they're like infighting. So you can see I'm already running out of ammo. But luckily there's some around the arena. So. Yeah, that guy just tried to Kamehameha. And I'm um, kind of running out of ammo again. Oh shit. Like I said, a lot of the health is going to come back during combat. Dude, that guy has a jetpack? I didn't notice that before. That's fucking awesome. I want a jetpack. I can get some fuel back here. They've actually done a really, I would say, good job with the combat in this game. Uh, it's very robust now. Like, extremely, extremely robust. Um, yeah, we're just not gonna find that, I guess. Or there's actually a thing going down there. Like I said, I'm not gonna spend forever looking for these things. Those questions marks, by the way, they're like cheat codes anyway, so, eh. At least one of the ones I found was basically like that, so.
My soul remains guarded. You can That's a big guy. The first hell priest has been terminated. For me. The demonic consumption of Earth has been reduced by 36.8%. There are two hell priests remaining. Oh. Man, I keep pressing E to... Well, the E is actually the button I'm supposed to be pressing. So here you can see I can't actually do anything else with this one. I You just basically get the full auto mod right now. So... This is how it is, but like I said, on the side it tells you more stuff that you eventually do get. I haven't gotten far enough in the game to get to that point, but like I said, it's like, uh... And yeah, there you go. Weapon swap. I would like this one instead. Objective marker. Yeah, so that's, uh, playing up, uh, objective in the world. So, just time more to go. And there's nothing else here, so we just continue. Like, I would say they really nailed down the combat in this game. Very much so. But where'd the other guy go? I guess he blew up too. Like, fucking amazing job, I have to say. The movement I have yet to see uh, too much of. Um, they definitely did a lot of that, and it can be kind of janky at times. Um, I'll actually show you a place that I found it to be kind of janky. I, before I didn't actually jump up there, I kind of went up here. And I was like, oh, like, oh, okay, I'll just hop up here. Look at that. Oh, there you go. I, did, I made it that time, but, like, that one is, like, you're kind of... I've noticed a lot of places when you're not intended to go up somewhere, like here, it's very invisible wally. Um, and then I just got to clip through that thing. So, it's not like they... They're not very friendly with, like, the secrets of going really into weird places. But they do have some fun stuff, though. So here's a little neat mechanic, which is, uh, their turn on the top is a weak point. So, he stops using the turret the minute you get rid of it. So, and then he can't long range attack you is the whole idea. Oh, by the way, spoiler, we're fighting that guy right now. So it's like giving it to you right now, I'd do that and... And yeah, just, just, just to make you guys happy, I'm gonna use this thing. Good, I'm out of ammo. I could just do this. But it's like I said, like I am trying to swap weapons right now. I don't have any other weapons. What the hell? Oh, guess I got rid of him. Oh, look, guys, it's a railgun. Can you believe it? But yeah, a lot of this is like... You see the movement is like kind of neat, like that. I don't know why I, I don't know why I said earlier about it, the comment I said, but... I mean, it's it's cool. Um, I haven't played around a lot with it yet, so... I don't really know if I really, really, really like it. Apparently I missed something right there. Oh, well, I think I knew that one I missed, but... Whatever. I should always kind of look back, but once again, those things I believe are secrets or something, I don't fucking care. <laughs> Dude, it's not a 100% run. Stop, stop criticizing me. Also, please criticize me. I love criticism. Alright, here's the weapon wheel. Now, I know what you're saying to yourself, and you're going to be like, well, it's a piece of game, Mike. You know, do you have to use the weapon wheel all the time and do this slow motion crap? Yes, this is a good way of like cheating the game, basically going like, I need time to think because I've been under a lot of pressure. 
But, uh, no, you can actually just switch weapons. Uh, this is one and two. Yes, number one is your shotgun. That's it. So. That's just how we are, guys. Alright, auto map station will reveal all undiscovered areas. Uh, check back re regularly. So, it's telling me that I'm a fucking casual. I missed something there, but that's okay. But there's plenty of stuff up here. A lot of stuff up here. What are these things, I wonder? The legend. Well, it's not really telling me. I think it's like where those Hell Knights or something were. Uh, we're just gonna say Cyber Demons. It's where they're, they're holding the Cyber Demons there. So it was a heavy cannon. I don't know if you saw the promotional material for this, but it's a cool weapon. Now, different enemies react differently to different weapons, which is kind of cool. Um, I'll kind of, when I get to that point. So this guy doesn't, doesn't care about the heavy cannon, obviously. So. But, uh, I'll, I'll kind of, when I get to a point, I'll show you some shit. Oh, it's this guy. So this guy will react to the heavy cannon and dodge it, see? I've noticed. Oh, fuck. I actually never took out his cannon. So I ran out of ammo for everything, so I just automatically swapped into that. So, you see what I mean about it? Like, they give you back a lot of HP. Especially because, like, you're not perfect in this, obviously. Except for me, I'm... I'm, I'm the ideal gamer, obviously. Why I have a racist Discord. Anyways, um... Yeah, no, they don't, they don't expect, uh... Perfection, but kind of how it is. And like, I'm already down to like 1 HP and 7 shots for this thing. And this is what I mean about like, you don't have a lot of ammo, so the whole point is you're supposed to run around and like, find ammunition like this. So, uh, that's not really what I want, but I'll take it. Behold the fruits of our labor. Once again, it's one of these things. They want me to like, drop in from above, so I have to... I think out there somewhere is, is a way in here. Uh, I can't just crouch into it. Oh, I feel like I, I feel like right there is the solution. Fuck! I think I missed my first jump. Okay, you see what I, you see what I mean about like the jumping? Sometimes feels like you're doing things you're not supposed to. There we go. Finally, I did it. Um, I just kind of like hump the wall and I kind of just look at it, so... <laughs> what can you do? I got an imp. So that's just a collectible. It's either a cheat code or a collectible, I don't know. One or, one or the other. Whatever, sue me. Oh, dude, a 1-up? Fuck yeah. Um, I have an extra life, so what does that even do? They immediately revive me if I run out of health. Once you run out of extra lives, losing all your health will send you back to the last checkpoint. Guys, I'll never need that. Trust me. I'm a god gamer. Is that everything here? Yeah, that would appear to be everything here. Ah, oh, some goodies over here. That, that, the explosive barrel not count, does not count as a goodie. Oh, that's a little bit far away. To expect that to do anything.
You know, I'm having a slightly easier time than the last time I was in here. Did I fuck something up somehow? <laughs> it's still a nightmare. Alright, never mind. I guess I'm just learning. This is what I mean about the fact that, like, if I play this enough, I'm... I just forgot if there's more guys here. I'm like, no, I guess not. The other key card. Let me go get some more ammo for this thing because we knew I know I had it there somewhere here. Yeah. No, oh, this is this is still a nightmare, guys. But like I said, I, I kind of now have played the game well, at least this section before, so. Now, I gotta show you this little thing. So, these little things have little cannons that go out the sides. So, they don't seem to hurt their own guys. They sure as hell fucking hurt me. I guess I could just get, kinda go up here. I don't know if there is anything up here. No, I guess not. Fuck you. I <laughs> knew that. Like I said, it's not like I'm right now knowing where everything is, so... I know it says blind, it'll be blind soon. I didn't lie to you. Any goodies in here? I guess really not. Alright guys, well we have all the upgrades for the shotgun, and you can't do anything else for these, so these ones... These weapon mods don't mean anything. We do have the heavy cannon. Alright, so... Do we want a precision bolt or uh, do we want a micro missiles? Um, it's a really hard to fuck. Who do you, whose channel do you think you're on? Honestly, Jesus! If you thought anything else, anybody you saw that? I mean, one eight hundred. Come on now. Hey, cool. Shit over here. Also, all right. And here you got the frag grenade, which apparently is a back attachment now. Instead of just chucking one. And I gradually re recharge over time. And he spends a really long time admiring it. His, his gear, you know? So Cacodemons have a weak point. Now, by the way, the weak points are very, very useful, like, in terms of, like... Realistically, they kind of expect you to be doing this all the time. That's kind of how it's designed, because the Cacodemon is, like, way tanky. and then I punch them out. They're like, they're just supremely tanky. So. By the way, this appeals so much to the kind of gameplay I like, by the way. <laughs> I love everything about this. Oh shit. Oh shit, there's one. This guy will not get off my dick. Oh fuck. Some health back. Oh, uh, hey, another one spawns. <laughs> it's really easy to take out their main weapon, actually. You know, we could just skip him and just, you know, go on to the next area. I don't want to fucking. I don't. Actually, I don't. I need some ammo. You can wait. Oh, dude, he's so smart, actually. Oh, dude, he actually can use those? I don't want to do that. Okay, well, I, I don't have any ammo for this. 
Oh, uh, you know, you can help me out here, buddy. I was actually a little bit worried that he was going to kill me. Actually, did I still have that extra life? Where is it? Where is it actually? Ah, oh, there. It's top left of my, my screen. But we're actually okay. Oh, there's some more ammo here, too. Oh, dude, I got 1 HP and ate that entire health back. There's also some stuff hidden over there. Any other goodies here? What's that thing, I wonder? Oh, well, that's the way forward, actually. What the fuck am I talking about? I got some friggin' surprise. Oh, dude, battle mix! Do I actually want to be over here? I guess I kind of do. Yeah, I do. I don't see anything out there. The UAC would like to thank you for your support during this transition. Your suffering continues to inspire us. I, I like how someone actually recorded that and goes, Oh, we'll never use that. Or it's a VI or AI or some shit. Oh. Oh, wait. I had the wrong thing completely fucking equipped. And he fucking destroyed me. Do you want? If there was any doubt, when um, that was on the right difficult, <laughs> that's on the right difficult setting. Where it is. Whoopsie Daisy. Some armor there. The hell? There we go. I made it up. Oh, he takes one bullet. Oh, shit. We probably will get something a little bit later that, uh... Does the glory fill kills a bit faster. I'm surprised that one didn't come out. Why has he got to be that way? Fuck. And this is what I mean about the cheat codes. That's the one I knew about. The only one I knew about, actually. <laughs> I don't know why there's a giant hentai monster trying to kill uh, Doom Guy, but you know. Uh, stranger things have happened. Why do you gotta fucking pick on that guy? Oh shit. <laughs> Alright, well, I think it's a good place to end it off, guys. Um, so next time we'll, uh, progression. Uh, see you later. Bye.